Yes, I love it. That was Sean on Daytime Chicago earlier this week. He's taking part in this year's Dancing with Chicago Celebrities. The event is next Friday, March 25th, and it is all for a fantastic cause, a fundraiser to raise money in the ongoing fight against breast cancer. Joining us this morning is my dance instructor, a very brave person, I might Ooh, say, <laughs> Ben Schwister and Amy Novotny from Arthur Murray Lakeview. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. So, uh, first of all, she's going to ask you about me, but I'm going to ask you, Amy, <laughs> about the event. It, it's been 16 years now, yes. um, and every year it kind of gets bigger and bigger, uh, and we, every Every year it raises money, it goes to Northwestern and the University of Chicago for breast cancer research. Yes, and it's been a joy to take part in it every year. The best part is that we have great people joining us from all over the city and we get to raise, we've raised and donated over $3.2 million locally in the fight against breast cancer. And it's not just for research, it also goes to provide mammograms for women in need. Correct. The silver lining has been our main benefactor for that and it costs $135 for a, a mammogram and so if you're willing to donate that makes a difference right like that. So we know you guys have been rehearsing like crazy. Ben, <laughs> we want you to spill the tea. What is it like teaching this one how to dance? Because you know he's kind of a diva on set. I don't know. No, I know. <laughs> um, well, that's a surprise. Yeah. Uh, he's actually a very hard worker. Aww. It's been a pleasure working with him. There's been moments for sure that we have to reset. work through and reset. reset. Oh, we'll call it reset. So what kind of dance are you giving us on uh, Friday? Um, so we're doing a medley. It's primarily a Lindy Hop. It's like a swing dance. And then there's a little bit of salsa. And then we've got our uh, human tricks. Is that what you were calling Stupid it? Stupid human tricks. Stupid yeah. human tricks. So yeah, we, we do a bunch of hopping. It's very athletic, really. I mean, it, I throw it, them around. Oh, are you going to give us a little sample, Sean Lewis? No, I think we have a little Sean, sample Sean, playing right now. Come on, it's your show. We see, why did see I invite you. you into this segment? We want to see everybody stand up. Let's do it. Let's do it. See, Brian, this is, give us some music. I don't, we don't have the music. He can't hear the music. Can you give us just give us a little sample of what a Lindy Hop looks like? Yeah, like, we'll, what? we'll do a, we'll do a six count basic. Okay. All right, we're gonna do that. So, All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got. We're, we're we gonna do. go. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, this is an eight count basic. Boom. That is eight count. Let's go to six. Boom, 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 boom. There you go. All right. So there we go. So All right. See, very are you happy. Easy to Thank move you. Around. I am so happy. <laughs> no, I have see? no salsa moves. You don't have okay. no salsa? Then you know what? You know, to so, see it in person, you have to come next Friday night. So Gator's is going to be there. There are tickets still available, yes? There are still tickets available, and any donation counts, so anything you can do helps the cause. So one of the reasons why uh, I have done this, uh, Dina Bear is on the board along with you. Yes. Uh, she asked me to do this and I was more than happy to. Uh, breast cancer has really impacted my life, my family. Uh, uh, 15 years ago in May, my mother, Chris, uh, passed away from her long battle with breast cancer. Uh, she was, she had just turned 57 years old when she passed. This was at a wedding, a family wedding, a little bit after her first, when she went into remission. Um, and she used to have longer hair and then she went to short hair and then her cancer came back five years later. Also, um, and people who watch the show know that I have a godson, Antonio. Uh, he's 19 now, he's in nursing school. His mother was one of my good friends from college, uh, Wendy. Uh, she was 27 when she was diagnosed with breast cancer uh, and she passed away when she was 33. Antonio was just six years old at the time. His grandmother has been instrumental in kind of picking up where Wendy left off and raising uh, raising Antonio into a fine young man. Uh, if you do have it in your budget and your heart, uh, we are still raising money for this wonderful cause. Um, and Sean, you're doing such a fabulous job. Top fundraiser still, Top right? Top fundraiser and the best running for the MVP award. And you know what? Mom and Wendy would be so important. proud, Sean. After Tuesday, uh, we raised another $4,000. WGN viewers are, you guys are we amazing. The best. Amazing. When you are asked to help, you help out. Um, so you can go on to any of our, uh, my social Social media, Twitter, uh, uh, Facebook, and what? Instagram. 
Uh, all of the platforms. And I have put a uh, post on there. I've also put the link that you can donate uh, to this uh, worthy cause. Also, we have what the kids call the QR code. Oh, here's the information. Mm -hmm. It happens uh, next Friday, uh, March 25th. Uh, AMDWCC.org is where you can go. Or you can uh, pick up your phone right now and you go to your phone app. Camera. You say, open up your camera and then you just put it over that and then you then the, the a link pops up right and you press on the link and it goes directly to the page where you can donate money so um, thank you if you have donated so far thank you so much from the bottom of my heart it's going to be going to a worthy cause and hopefully a very fun night it's next Friday it's gonna be so, fun. so Amy and Ben thank wait. you so much thank you thank you all right